Lacrosse is the fastest growing sport in the nation, and that rings true in our own backyard, especially for girls. In fact, it's seen quick enough expansion that Billings now has two high school teams, which has opened doors for the future. The life lessons they learn in this is phenomenal. There, there's, and it's great for the girls to know that there's other sports out there, there's other options. Like being able to like now um, playing all the way up through high school and then the opportunity to go play in college is huge right now. And so I think that that's fantastic. The Rimrock lacrosse team features several girls that have been playing together for years, but they seem to have a similar story on their introduction to the game. Well, my dad had played in high school back east, and then he got my sisters into it, and so then I wanted to try. My dad played at the Air Force Academy, so when we moved back to Montana, he was like, we're going to do this as a family, and so my four siblings and I started playing. So all five of us have loved the sport and have just like played it as, played it as a family. Lacrosse is one of the more physically demanding sports out there. Bailey says that his girls will run on average between four and five miles in their matches. Then add in the hockey aspect of physicality and it can take quite the toll on the body throughout the year. I mean we definitely go through conditioning throughout the season to get us, get our bodies conditioned for playing in like a rough environment. Um, but by the end of the season a lot of us are kind of beaten and bruised, um, literally and physically, but it's all worth it in the end. While the Rimrock lacrosse team can be seen as a sort of pioneer in their sport, expect the growth to continue. Billings, Alec Boffinger, MTN Sports.